Welcome back to A Moment in History. I'm Seth Udinsky. Today we travel back to the eve of the American Revolution in March of 1775. Tension had been rising for decades between the colonies in America and the British Empire. It had now reached a point where the colonists had to decide if they would fight for their independence against the most powerful empire on earth or remain as subjects to the British throne. On March 23rd, 1775, a fiery patriot named Patrick Henry pushed the cause of independence with seven immortal words that would go down in American history, give me liberty or give me death. Born in Virginia in 1736, Henry became a lawyer as a young man and soon after he entered the political sphere. He became a ferocious and dynamic speaker and would be remembered as one of America's most gifted orators. As divine providence would have it, Henry rose to prominence in the political scene just as the rumblings of war began to grow between the colonies and the empire. In March of 1775, the Second Virginia Convention met in Richmond to determine if the colonies should attempt to break away from the British Empire and declare their independence. Among those present at the convention were future U.S. Presidents George Washington and Thomas Jefferson. Many in the Second Virginia Convention were content with a non-violent resolution in dealing with the strong reach and unfair treatment from the British Crown, but not Patrick Henry. He ferociously called for an army to be raised and insisted the only way to achieve peace with Britain was to achieve freedom from Britain. War was already upon them, and the colonists had no choice but to fight for their independence. Henry, who was a devout Christian, quoted the words of the prophet Jeremiah as he barreled towards the speech's legendary culmination. He spoke these fateful words that would inspire the colonies to fight for their independence. Gentlemen may cry, peace, peace, but there is no peace. The war is actually begun. Our brethren are already in the field. Why stand we here idle? Is life so dear or peace so sweet as to be purchased at the price of chains and slavery? Forbid it, almighty God. I know not what course others may take, but as for me, give me liberty or give me death. Patrick Henry accomplished his goal with these inspiring words. The colonies would go to war a few months later, and in one of the most dramatic military upsets in world history, the United States would win its independence from Great Britain in 1783. The fledgling country would eventually unseat the British Empire as the most powerful nation in the world, and the words of its greatest orator, Patrick Henry, still ring true today. Thanks so much for joining me once again for A Moment in History.